If you were to go around and ask a hundred people, hey, what's the most important job in the world? I mean, without this, the world would fall apart. Everything would cease to exist. Your life would be in total shambles. I guarantee you, you know what you thought when I asked, what is the most important job in the world? I guarantee you didn't think a college professor. You probably thought a doctor, a firefighter, a soldier. All these things are very functional in our society and help keep things going, not a guy that stands there and reads the syllabus the first time you meet him, telling him how if you vape in the back of the classroom, I'm going to fail you. Yes, this is what's going on in our higher institutions of learning, at least in the United States. I don't, I don't know what's going on across the pond. I don't know what's going on in South America. I really don't know what's going on in China. Who knows what professors are teaching them over there? Probably how to take over the world and world domination. A more useful skill than a movie review class or underwater basket weaving. All real degrees in America. When I tell you professors do fuck all, I mean it. I mean, it doesn't make any sense why we give them tenure or I think some of them make six figures and don't tell them, oh, well, okay, I worked so hard for my degree and, and I had to get a PhD in sociology just so I can, no, I don't care. I don't care that you wasted eight to 10 years of your life and got 200K in debt just so that the only job you could find at the end is to continue the Ponzi scheme instead of going out and working at Panera. I'm sorry, that that is the best you could do. You know, some people are measured for greatness. They're measured, they're destined to do great things. Other people are destined to be professors. And you can clearly tell where I side. Now, where does this come from? Where does this salt come from? Where does my pain come from? It comes from the fact that despite all these years in school, you would think even after the pandemic, you would think, okay, maybe less and less people are going to college. Let me step up my game. Let me Michael Jordan this bitch and make some shots. Nope, we don't do any of that. You know what they do? They triple down on their bullshit policies. I have this one professor and you know what she believes? Well, being sick is not an acceptable excuse for missing class. So basically, I could come in, no mask, full corona positive, doesn't matter. I can do all that, get everybody sick, set everyone back a week, but I, I didn't miss class. I, I didn't miss class. Hey, I, I showed up, you know? I was doing what the professor told me to do. I came, I sat, went to lecture, took notes. I even asked questions, got participation. But I was positive for the plague. But hey, that is, that's the world we live in. That you can still, after all that's happened over the last two years, people still have these policies. So it makes me beg the question, why? Why, why do we, why is there no, some, no, why isn't there any objective review? You know how dumb tenure is but caleb how they need job security let me tell you something how many people are gonna get phds in finance how many people are out here getting phds in mathematics job security nobody else you have to be by the time you become a professor you've exhausted all the other job options i don't think they got a lot of competition all i'm asking is for some set of standards that's all i want you know i want to go in Come to class, you know, okay, whether or not I vape, that's besides the point. We can get to that another time. But I want to be able to just go to lecture, relax, you know, pretend to learn something, because let's be real here. Who learn, Who reads? Like, who, who, who actually reads? Name one person. And the people you know who read, like, come on, they're reading, but do they have anything else to do with their time? This, let's not let's not get into this this could be a whole thing but 
I just want, I just want, you know, education for all. I want things to be fair. And most importantly, I want to be able to miss class on a sick day and be able to call in and not have to worry about my grade. But that's too much to ask for. You know, I'm just going to get into debt, you know, join the workforce and, you know, that's what it, just to pay off. I'm going to do everything society tells me. Get the degree, get the wife, get the 2.2 kids, get divorced eight years later, and then, you know, tell continue happy wife happy life and continue that's that's exactly what i'm gonna do anyways thanks for this little rant um thanks everyone for watching i know that there's some new people here just i just want to say thank you it means a lot that you're able to click on this video and um thank you um, respond to any comments down below and